Secret Life of Test 2 Single Close Dash, Dark Phoenix, at Box Office, Los Angeles after nearly 20 years and a dozen films, the current manifestation of x Dash Men movies is going out with a whimper. Forged by four reviews, the million Dark Phoenix earned a franchise low of million from 3,721 North American locations over the weekend for a second place finish, according to Studio S in its Sunday. First place went instead to the secret life of Test 2. The Universal Pictures and Illumination sequel, featuring the voices of Kevin, Hart, Tiffany Haddish and Harrison Ford in his first animated role, grows an estimated up 1 million in ticket sales. Although less than half of what the first film opened to in 2016, it's still a major win for the studio, considering the production budget was around million. Including international grosses, its global total is already sitting at million. It's a fantastic result, said Jim Orr, Universal, president of domestic theatrical distribution. We couldn't be more proud to partner with, CEO, Chris Melodandri and everyone at Illumination. He noted that this is the ninth number one opening for Illumination, the animated arm responsible for the Despicable Me movies. With decidedly less stellar results, Dark Phoenix trails behind the talking animal. Directed by longtime X Dash Men's prize Simon Finberg, it focuses on Jean Grey who is played by Sophie Turner fresh off of her Game of Thrones run at Santa Stark. It also brings back James and the boy, Michael Fassbender and Jennifer Lawrence. It's the facto conclusion to the modern X Dash Men movies that started in 2000, and also the first major 20th century Fox film to be released by the Walt Disney Co following the acquisition. But the quality wasn't there and it scored even worse, reviews overall than the widely disparaged X-Men, Apocalypse. Audiences who showed up seemed to concur with the critics, giving it a deadly b sign mass score. It's softer than we hope, said Kathleen Cass, Disney's president of theatrical distribution. While the film didn't open the way we wanted, we think the legacy of the X Dash Men series is important and it's more important than how when film opens. We're trying to keep it in perspective. Paul Dirbrevedian, the senior media analyst for Tons 4 noted even with the lackluster North American debut and reception, that internationally Dark Phoenix was number one with millions from 53 territories including China. Globally, it earned millions. In the international marketplace, it seems like the spectacle and the brand room house, their Dorothean said. Also, the X Dash Men characters, which have been licensed to Fox, are now expected to be integrated with Disney's stable of characters in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Plus, Disney has another winner in its book in Aladdin, which posted to third place in its third weekend with another dot five million. Globally it has earned dot nine million to date. Warner Bros. Godzilla, King of the Monsters had a Titan-sized second weekend fall, however, down 67% with top 5 million. And the acclaimed Elton John biopic Rothman, from Paramount Pictures, rounded out the top 5 with millions. While wide releases are having mixed results lately, independent and platform releases are finding healthy audiences. After Booksmart failed to make a major dent going wide out of the gate, Amazon Studios opened its Mindy Kaling and Emma Thompson comedy late, night in four theaters, where it earned a healthy comic 654 this weekend, before expanding nationwide next week. Employing a similar strategy, A24, at the last black man in San Francisco also scored in seven locations with comic 744. Also, overall the box office is healthy. The weekend is up 37% from last year when Ocean Date opened and the year-to-date deficit improved again. The year is now down 5.9%. Some movies may have not lived up to expectations, but the marketplace is knocking down the year-to-date deficit at a really fast pace, their Zerubedian said. Estimated ticket sales for Friday through Sunday at U.S. and Canadian theaters, according to Comscore. Where available, the latest international numbers for Friday through Sunday are also included. Final domestic figures will be released Monday. Wind of the Secret, Life of Pet 2, Dot 1 million, million international. 3. Aladdin, Dot 5 million, 
Justice Million International. For Dot Godzilla, King of the Monsters, Dot 5 Million, Dot 1 Million International. Five Dot Rothman, Million, Million International. Six Dot Ma, Dot 8 Million, Million International. Seven Dot John Wick, Chapter 3 Parabellum, Dot 4 Million, Dot 1 Million International. Eight Dot Avengers, Endgame, Dot 8 Million, Dot 8 Million International. 9. Postman Detective Kai Kasu, Million, Dot 1 Million International. 10. Booksmart, Dot 6 Million, Comma 000, 000, 000 International. Estimated ticket sales for Friday through Sunday at international theaters, excluding the US and Canada, according to Comscore. 2. Aladdin, Dot 6 Million. 3. Dot Zillet, King of Monsters, Dot 1 Million. 4. My Best Summer, Yui Heo's Woe Men, Dot 7 Million. 5. Chasing the Dragon 2, Wild Wild Bunch, Dot 4 Million. 6. Parasite, Dot 8 Million. 7. The Secret Life of Pets 2, Million. 8. Rothman, Million. 9. John Wick, Chapter 3 Heartland, Dot 1 Million. 10. Postman Detective Kai Kashu, Dot 1 million. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe.